You're watching Day to Day with Justine Ray with Day to Day at Downpour. And right now we're backstage. The acts are starting to come in. And we have someone making a special appearance tonight. No one other than the talented, fabulous, beautiful Catherine Minette, Miss East Coast American Nation. Catherine, thank you so much for being with us today. Now, let's talk about your title, Miss East Coast American Nation. What was that process like of you achieving that huge role? Well, of course, pageantry takes a lot of preparation. There was a swimsuit competition, an evening gown competition, and an interview. And in the end, I was successful. But basically, preparation is going to the gym, practicing with a coach, what kind of answers you would give for the onstage question, and picking out the right gown. What did your gown look like? My gown was actually completely tan and very sparkly and mostly see-through, so it was really gorgeous. Wow, I got to see that really working with your coloring very nicely. Now, you were also talking about, you know, the questions that they ask you. What are some of the questions you had to prepare? Well, um, some of the questions I have gotten could span from what did you feel about when Michael Jackson died or, you know, if you could help one charity, what would it be? So you really have to think about, you know, your goals in life and what you would like to do and also what you think about current events. Speaking of charities, are there any charities that you have been, you know, working with or any volunteer work that you've been doing as Miss East Coast American Nation? Well, my platform for pageantry is finding permanent homes for children in foster care. So um, I've worked with Hope for Youth recently, and um, we had a pajama drive. We collected over 40 pairs of pajamas for Hope for Youth, so that was great. It was an excellent cause. Now, besides having all your Miss East Coast American Nation duties, being an actress and a model, you are in school. How do you do it? It is a balancing routine. I go to school at Hofstra right here on Long Island. Um, I observe in elementary schools because I am an education major. I work, I act, so I'm basically busy all the time, but it's so worth it. I love everything that I do, and when you love what you do, it's, it doesn't feel like work at all. Where do you work? I actually work at Hofstra as well. I make phone calls and ask people to donate to the university, so. <laughs> it's a I'm sure you got a lot of donations, but you're, you're so cool and nice. <laughs> now, what are your goals for the future? Well, I want to continue acting, and um, I'm an education major and a writer, so one day I hope to be a principal of an elementary school, maybe get some books published, you know. I really, I really don't know what the future holds for me, but I'm really excited to find out. Well, clearly the sky is the limit for Catherine Monet. Please like her on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. This girl's going places. You're watching Day to Day with Justine Ray, and this is Day to Day at Downpour.